Multiple roads are back open in Claremont after a police standoff ended just about an hour ago. Fox 5's Elizabeth Alvarez joins us live with all those details. Liz, what do you know? Well, like you said, yeah, that police standoff ended peacefully around about an hour and a half ago here along the Claremont Mesa Boulevard. It is now back open and the suspect was arrested. So here is what happened. We do have video, in fact, of the suspect being arrested. Let's roll that and show you. He was in handcuffs and was put in a patrol car. Just after 1 a.m., San Diego police got a 911 text that a woman was being threatened and being held hostage in an apartment. Police showed up to 5250 55 Claremont Mesa to investigate and they learned that there was indeed a woman and a man inside one of the units. Now police in tactical gear were called out after the man refused to come out. Three hours later, the woman comes out. She was not hurt. Then around 4 a.m., the suspect ended up surrendering to police. Police say this may have started as a domestic violence incident. Here is Lieutenant Adam Sharkey with SDPD. Uh, that suspect has been identified as Brandon Grosso, G-R-O-S-S-O. -S -S uh, he's being arrested for false imprisonment, among other charges. I also believe he's being arrested for committing a felony while out on bail. We still have to conduct the investigation into the, uh, the false imprisonment. Uh, this may be a domestic violence incident, so we have to investigate the domestic violence aspect of this. So still very early in the investigation. The good news is everybody is safe. The suspect is in custody, and the neighborhood can kind of get back to normal. Back out here live, and that is what has happened. The neighborhood is now back to normal, and Claremont Mesa Boulevard, once again, is back open. We're live in Claremont Mesa, guys. We'll send things back to you in the studio. Okay, Liz Alvarez, thanks for the update.